Hey guys, it is me here, and I have exciting news. We are going to start doing some gaming. So, don't worry, I'll do Nerf movies too, but... See, we're going to be using, usually doing these three apps. Usually going to be doing Clash Royale. I'm a big Clash Royale fan. I am in Arena 7. And I'm just going to... I'm not going to do... This is not going to be a long video, probably like three or four minutes. And so... Here we go. Um, I'm going to show you guys a replay of me um, battling a spawner deck. And I'm going to show you how to beat a spawner deck. This guy is spawner deck i have my normal deck and this is a tournament battle if you're wondering and we are playing matt m from veracity okay here we go so he's going to i'm going to play a hog rider he's going to play a goblin hut and some minions and then so yeah the hog rider is going to get two swings off They're really solid so we're going to put a baby dragon in for the minions and the screw goblins yeah, there that goes. So yeah, for for spawner decks, you always wanna use your spell all your not all your spells, like spells like maybe lightning, rocket, goblin barrel. In this case I have goblin barrel. Not arrows or zap. Use that for other things. But yeah, I put down my ice wizard and then I'm gonna goblin barrel spawners. So always goblin barrel their spawners and now use your use your spells on the spawners and attack the other side. That's what I'm gonna do here. I'm gonna put a hog rider on the right side so we cannot put his spawners down. Use force to defend it. So if you attack the other side, they're forced to put to they're forced to defend it so they can't put spawners down. So I'm gonna put a baby dragon on the left. And then I'm gonna put a ice wizard for his wizard because it can actually do a lot of damage i think wizards are really good because the one hit spear goblins one hit minions one hit regular goblins and they can do a lot of damage to witches and that their area damage is like over nine thousand. but yeah we're gonna put some barbarians for his witch um we are going to goblin barrel his goblin spear goblin hut and then go, there goes my barbarians on the right side. He doesn't have anything for it, so those barbarians are going to do a lot of damage. So he puts down a minion horde finally, and we're going to take out his tower. So there we go. So then, there's only 50 seconds left. I'm going to put a minion horde for his uh, giant he puts down. I'm going to put an ice wizard in the back. Um, I'm going to then put a baby dragon. And we've got to put a wizard. I'm going to put some spear goblins and a hog rider inside his base. And then I, if I would have saved that zap, I would have got the minion horde the, and both towers, which would be pretty nice. So then he puts down a giant. I'm going to have to counter some barbarians. Then look at that one minion staying alive. We put a baby dragon there and a hog rider. We're going right, to put a hog rider. We want to take out that last tower just for funsies and there we go we take out the last tower he just arrows my tower and there we go so yeah so we're gonna do so, there's no live attacks today sadly we were just doing one replay um i'll do some more gaming like maybe boom beach or clash clans i'm not that great in boom clash clans i like boom beach a lot um yeah this is my clan soon 25 my name is itchy nostril kind of funky name but yeah so I'll do some more tournament battles I'm gonna use this deck soon I'm gonna make a video on it a giant skeleton giant skeleton minion horde witch rocket goblins spear goblins barbarians and giant I just need a gym a little bit to get those goblins upgraded get these goblins okay um so yeah Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys.